All right, so before we get into today's video, make sure to like the video, make sure to subscribe to the channel, make sure to hit that bell and turn on post notifications. So you, my friend, are notified every time we drop, and you know you'll be notified every time we drop, right? So with that being said, we got London's Ways joints today. Hold on, quick. Hold, hold on, quick. You already my text and all. Hold on. With that being said, we got London Ways video today. We're gonna see what he's talking about. Hopefully, he's talking about something. Hopefully, he. Hopefully he back. Hopefully he he's actually back in reality a little bit with these videos. You know we've been we've been catching their ass up real bad. They've been big slipping lately. So, but anyways, with that being said, since they want us to believe their content is real, we're gonna react to their content like it's real. Damn! Oh my God! Who is this? I'm not gonna lie. She thick as hell, especially for a snowflake. She look good too. Hey, how you doing? You gorgeous. Oh, thank you. What's your name? I'm London. I'm Jamie. Nice to meet you. Can you shake my hand? Nice Hi. to meet you. Nice to meet you. How's your day going? It's good. It's good. I'm headed to yoga right now. Okay, smooth, smooth. You from LA? Yeah, I'm from LA. And you? Nice. I just moved out here from New York. Uh -huh. <clears throat> All right, bro. So peep this, man. I'm going to do something a little different, just slightly different on this video. This intro, okay, all right, so where you headed to? I'm going to go ahead in the yoga class. I'm headed to the yoga class right now. So instead of picking up on a, on a clue, see, this is what I'm talking about. It's how, it's how, it's, this is why I say this nigga ain't got no communication skills with women. This is why I say he's allowed his money, his clothes, his watch, and his car to do talking for him instead of actually having game, right? So she told you she's about to head to the yoga class. And instead of picking up on that part portion of the conversation, he goes all out of well, you, well, hey, uh, you from where you from? You where you from? You from L.A.? Like, nigga, that has nothing to do with what she just say. Follow the conversation, you big fat nigga. Basically, you should have said, oh, yoga class, that's cool. Well, how about this? Um, how about she's is it close? Is, is yoga class close by? I mean, hey, I, I, I can. You see what I'm saying? Is, is, is the building close by? You going to? I just have, I, I just walk with you and talk to you until you go to yoga class. That's cool with you. You see what I'm saying? So he immediately takes it off of what she's doing, right? And focus on her. Immediately ask a question about something completely irrelevant, bro. Stay on topic, big nigga. Stay on topic. And this is what I be saying. This is what I be saying about a lot of cats in real life. That's why y'all be losing out because y'all don't know how to stay on topic. A girl will tell you something and instead of capitalizing off of what she say, you want to talk about, yeah, I brushed my hair, man. That's why I got all these waves and shit. You know what I'm saying? You want to go off the deep end. But anyway, let's continue watching. Okay, how do you like it? I mean, it's cool. I just, re I really just got here like a week ago. So I'm just trying to stroll sure. through the neighborhood and everything. I just came from a little appointment back there. Oh, nice. Well, anything? I don't want to be late, so I think I'm going to keep going. Okay, no problem. What, what, maybe, um, you know, I can get your number or something. We can get to know each other. I don't know about that. I've been seeing someone. Oh, yeah? I mean, you know what I'm saying? We can just be on some cool shit, bro. Mm, I don't know. I'm really going to be late, actually. So. so I can't get your number? No, I'm sorry. It was nice to meet you, though. All right, that's all. Go have a good one. See, he, see he's fumbling the bag, y'all. You fumbling the bag, bro. And see, you're supposed to continue to do well. Yoga class, I, I've, I've been seeing it on TV. So I've been seeing it on TV. So, like, what it, like, like what exactly does that do? Is it, is it good for the body, stretching wise? And you you got I curious about what the hell are they talking about, bro. <laughs> like switch your shit up, bro. Quit talking about where you're from. This that you look gorgeous. You look this. You look that. You have no conversation at all. You know what I'm saying? You can't wait to okay, all right, beep beep. You can't wait to run back to the whip, bro. That's all. That's all. That's all you anticipate. You anticipate getting dissed and boo boo. That's what you anticipate, y'all. And then look, and then sitting there looking at the rearview mirror like yes, yeah. oh you know you know get in the car like, yeah, looking at the rearview. You know what I'm saying? Come on, bro, cut cut the crap out, man. You should have capitalized off of the, off of her going to put her going to a yoga to talk to her about what yoga do for the body is it good da, da, or do the dudes be in yoga while walking her to the building to where she goes to yoga, and then after that, well hey you know it was cool meeting you. Hopefully you have a good workout, such and such. Uh, <clears throat> hope you have a good workout, such and such. Well, hey, um, can I get your number? You know, we can exchange numbers. 
You know what I'm saying? Maybe we can go out. Maybe we can go out eat some healthy food. Like, something of that nature, bro. Instead of where you're from. You from LA? I'm from New York. Okay, well, what you doing? Come on, bro. Like, get your shit together, man. And I'm not saying that what I just said is gonna work, but stay, nigga, stay on topic, bro. Stay on topic. The objective is to get the woman. So in order for you to get the woman, you have to low key, even if you're fronting, low key act like you're interested in what the fuck she's interested in because that's her interest, nigga. Man, if y'all don't listen, focus on what she interested in. I interested in what she interested in, even if you're not interested in her. Because that's her interest, nigga. The objective to get the girl is to be of interest. Understand what she's interested in. Use y'all's brain. In this case, this nigga ain't got one. Damn, she was thick, bro. I ain't gonna lie. She was stupid thick. Damn. Was that found a time? Number three, four. Oh, got one, coach. Huh. Oh. What's okay. up? What's oh, good? Oh, cool. What you mean, cool? You got cool? this all the way from New York? I mean, nice. Yeah, I shipped it. What's up? Oh, damn, you shipped it, too. Mm -hmm. That's a nice car you got here. I appreciate it. Thank you. Hmm. What's up, though? Um, I just wanted to know, like, what's up? Did you still want to get my number? I could show you around LA. I mean, you just told me that you've been seeing somebody, right? Mm, yeah, but it's, it's so new that, like, it's not a big deal. I could just show you around. I mean, that's basically what I was saying, but you wasn't interested in that. Well, maybe I changed my mind because... Yeah, but it don't work on your time, though. Hmm. Wait one second. What's up? Um, I don't know. There's, like, so many spots I could show you around, like, in L.A. Like, I could take you out somewhere nice to eat or something. Oh, you could take me out. Yeah, I'd like to get to know you. Maybe we could drive around a little bit. That could be fun. I mean, I don't know, man. It's just like, I'm just confused on why your energy was like that back there. Now, none of that even matters, bro. Shorty literally said this. Well, you know, there's a lot of places around here. I can take you out. He saw you can take me out. She's like, yeah, there's a lot of places. Well, I'm confused about why your energy was. Nigga, that's completely irrelevant. She don't know you. You don't know her. Y'all are both strangers. She's talking about spending money on you. So what did she saw you got a nice car? So what did she thought you was, you was some big ass fat nigga that ain't had nothing um, in the beginning? Who cares? What matters is now, Shorty's talking about trying to spend some bread. And here he go with this bullshit. Now, is this a girl that I, me personally, would I hang out with? I mean, yeah, I hang out with her. Now, am I going to wife her up? Absolutely not. I'm not going to wife you up, but you can be one of my girlfriends, though. When, you, when you're around me, you're my girlfriend. So whatever you got going on, you need to mute, mute them text threads, put on do not disturb. But when you ain't around me, you do what you want to do. That's how I look at it. Well, I was just a little bit worried that I'd be late, but I realized I actually have like 15 minutes. So maybe we could talk a little longer. And then I mean, what we, what we need to talk about, you just told me you got to do. You're not interested. You ain't want to give me your number. Why now? What's the I'm, what's the difference between me over there and me right here? I mean, the thing is, like, I think that we could have a really good vibe. I mean, I'm also very like business oriented. I can tell that you're out here. You definitely got some good stuff going on. Let's get to know you better. Um, I think we can have a lot of fun. I don't know how I know you're genuine. Well, just let me have your number, and then you can find that out yourself. I'll take your number. Okay. Bruh, she literally said that y'all can have a lot of fun. She literally, basically, y'all can hang out. Y'all can go out to these spots, kick it. She can show you around. And y'all can have fun. We, 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 we're we we're grown enough to know what she mean by what she said. Y'all can have fun. Now, on the other hand, brother, um, on the other hand, her being genuine does not mean have anything to do with anything, bro. You worry about the wrong stuff. How I don't know you're not, how you know you're genuine. It doesn't matter if she's genuine or not, bro. All that matters is just Shorty's trying to take you out, have fun. Like, I mean, be cool. She's trying to get you some. You know, like, you know, the more appealing you are, the more you want to attract. Um, you got a nice whip, you're going to attract nice people. You dress nice. Some Most of the time when you dress nice, you can attract nice people. But nowadays, anybody can dress nice. But I'm just saying, man, like... Stop with the 
relationship questions in in a non-relationship situation. You see what I'm saying? What's your number, Ryan? Right? Okay, let me just call myself really quickly so I have it saved as well. Well, I'll hit you when it's convenient for me. Mmm. Damn. What you mean, damn? Well... But you look good, though. Thank you. Thank you. You look good, too. You should do a little 360 for me. Okay, it's all there, too. <laughs> it's all there. Thank but, you. um... What's up? I'm about to get going, though. You said you got an appointment. I don't want you to be late. Yeah. Yeah, you're right. You're right. Okay, well, I guess I'll talk to you. Yeah, I got your number, so I'll hit you up if I, if I want to see you or not. Okay. All right, so I'm going I'm to give y'all some game. Peep game. So, um... I want y'all peep this out. Um... I keep talking about I want y'all to check this out, peep this out. I ain't even saying that. I'm just here saying, um. But no. All right, all right, fellas. When when a woman puts they when a woman either when a woman puts their number in your phone, right? And they call, they call their number from your phone, that's how you know that you in her, right? Now it's up to you to do what you need to do to keep that. Now you could be a lame nigga, you can fuck it all the way up. But like most cats, but for the most part, it's up to you. You see what I'm saying? Well, hopefully you do, because I really want to get to know you. You seem like a good time. You got some good things going. Is you a good time? I'm a good time. In every way? Yes, every way. You're going to have to show me. Actions speak louder than words. Mm, okay, sure. I can show you. Right now, then. What we waiting on? All right. Let's go. Man, I didn't say we was going nowhere. We could talk a little bit. Okay, sounds good. Got one, coach. All right, homeboy a little awkward, bro. Um, you ask her if she was a good time. She said, yes. She said in every way. She's like, yes. And then you're like, well, well, you got to show me. She's like, okay, I can. Basically, I can show you I'm a good time. All right, well, hop in. She's like, okay. He said, I didn't say we was going anywhere, but we can. And how's she going <laughs> to... How's she going to show you that she's a good time, bro, if you're not going to go anywhere? But she both show you she's a good time sitting, sitting in the car? I'm confused, bro. I, like I said, this shit right here, man. This shit getting to the point to where it just... This shit getting to the point to where it's too crazy for me, bro. Because what's supposed to get you right? You're supposed to show you what? Matter of fact, I ain't even, I'm not even finna jump ahead. Because we about to see. We about to see, is he going to do some ghost? Let's see. Because, I mean... Or are you just going to make her sit in the car and, and prove that she's a good time by just talking? Like, <laughs> crazy, man. Don't you look good, though? So, what's up? Um, wow. This car is so pretty. I've never seen one this nice before. For sure. I mean, there's plenty of Lamborghinis in LA. Yeah, but this one, I like the interior, the color. Everything is so nice. Wow. I love it. What up? I feel it, yeah. Did you get it custom made or something? Nah, um, when I just bought it, they already had it like this. Mmm, okay, okay. Mm -hmm. So what do you do? Uh, I'm an entrepreneur. So that sounds like you got a lot of businesses. Like, I do I do a lot, you know what I mean? I'm into real estate, crypto. I own exotic uh, exotic rental company. So I do a few things. Okay, cool. Well, um, I could def. I would love to learn from you. Maybe we can have some food or something. I'm a I'm a part full time model right now, so I have some time, and I'd love to get like into real estate or like okay. know more about that stuff. Well, That'd yeah, I definitely awesome. could. Uh, you know, school you on that. I'm okay. just a little confused though. So you gotta do it or you don't. Like, what's up? I mean, we just started talking like a month ago. So like. I'm still figuring it out. I don't even know if he's my type, really. So, I think it's okay. I mean, so what is your type? My type is business-oriented. Business-oriented. Someone with a business mind. Someone that got their shit together. Um, and a guy like you. You're handsome. All right. I told you I was going to react a little different, but still the same. So, basically, what Shorty said is maybe you could show her how to do this and do that. So, basically, what Shorty said is... Hopefully, brother, you can put me up on game about how to get money in different areas, meaning that you can help me get the money. And on top of you put me up on game how to get the money, basically, you can get probably a portion or you see what I'm saying? She seems like she's one of them types that you're going to send out, do this. <coughs> um, you're going you're gonna to give her the stipulation. I'm getting 25% of what you make. She all right, cool. She, she seems like she has signed a contract. She seems like she's down for that. 
And then um, here he goes with the question. So what about the dude? <laughs> we all know. <clears throat> Let's be 100. Let's be. We have to. We have to be realistic with ourselves, y'all. That 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 little sexy little bad little thing walking around with the fat ass cute face. Just know she got dick on the line that she needed, bro. Okay. Just know there's niggas on the line who've been on the line for like six months trying to hit that she ain't never let hit. Understand that. Now I ain't saying Shorty's the coldest. I ain't saying none of that. But Shorty's face. Shorty look high. Right, okay. Shorty look high. Right. So best believe she's going to have a nigga she's talking to. Best believe she's going to have a nigga she's fucking. Best believe she's going to have other niggas that she probably went out on a date with. And them niggas was a soul just gone off of her. And she's kind of blown them off, but they're still right there. So quit asking these dumbass questions, bro. Like, come on, man. Like, to all, all, all my sexy women, if you, if you sexy and you watching this video. You ain't got to, if you want to say it in the chat or in the comment section below, you can. You ain't got to. I'm talking about sexy as far, and I ain't talking about fake sexy. I ain't talking about, you know, you're, you're, you're a three, and you're talking about, yeah, I'm a ten. No, I'm talking about motherfuckers who everybody can look at like that motherfucker sexy, right? Um, Come on. You know you got multiple dudes that's on your ass. You, if you got if you go to work, there's like five niggas at your job, probably more than that, that's on your ass. You go to the you go to this one store that you always visit. There's always that one nigga, maybe two niggas that's always working. They be on your ass. And then you got this nigga, the ex that you used to mess with, he's still low-key on your ass. Then you got this new dude that you're talking to. He still he, he he all up on it because you something new he ain't never had. He wanna keep. So just understand. A sexy broad always gonna have somebody on the line. Whether they fucking them, whether they talking to him, whether they doing whatever. They always gonna have access. To another man. I fuck with that. Appreciate it, appreciate it. Mm -hmm. But if I was handsome and you telling me that you ain't know if y'all what, what type of terms y'all was on, why you ain't give me that energy back there? I don't know. I think that I got to know you a little bit better when I saw you in this car. I mean, what did my car got to do with anything? It got it got a lot to do with it actually. Like what? That you're smart. You must be smart. Not any dumb not just comes up on a a Lambo. <laughs> that's true. That's true. Yeah. I don't know though. I just feel like I don't know if this is genuine for real. But you said you a good time, right? Yeah, I'm a good time. I mean, you ain't showed me no. Yeah, that you a good time. Well, I can show you. Oh well, yeah. How are you gonna do that? Just take me on a date first, and I'll show you. Mm, you gonna show me after the date? Yes, I'll show you after the date. <laughs> okay, okay. I'm not gonna be that easy on the first I mean, day. Shit, on the first day that I meet you. I mean, you said after the date. Yeah. So after the date, you get to see. Okay, shorty's easy. Point blank, my point is I'm trying to explain before. Those relationship questions about do this, do that, that's completely irrelevant. Um, basically, her own requirements really is that you look, you have a little something. Okay, it is what it is. Why you want to look good and fuck with bummy, scrubby ass niggas? That, 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 don't make my, that don't make no sense to me. You look good, you want to mess with somebody who got something, something, something. Completely understandable. Um, now... Basically, all you all you got to do, London, all this big ass nigga got to do, right, is take her out to eat, take her on some date somewhere. Let's, hey, let's go out to eat and go to a fucking movie. Let's go out to eat and it's any date, and then you can get the action. The B one hundred, she seemed like she drank. Shorty seemed like she she she, 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 she seemed like she liked to drink, take shots, and all that shit, and get right. You know what I'm saying? So she says she's not easy, but that's easy. It's very, very easy. Now, she's not super, super easy to where you can meet her. Hey, come to the crib. But according to the, according to what we see, okay? Because we are going to go based off of most of the time what we see, but also based off of shit that I kind of known and seen in real life. So. You talking like you nasty or something? Um, I can get a little bit nasty. What do you like to do? What do you define nasty? I mean... I'm into whatever, you know what I'm saying? As long as it ain't no weird. Okay, me too. So it sounds like we can have a good time. What you like? Um, kind of have a foot fetish. A foot fetish? A little bit. Like, Not you like, you like feet? I like, I like when people play with my feet. Mm, that's your stuff. <laughs> no, it's crazy. I ain't, I'm be honest. I ain't really into feet. Really? Nah. I mean, I'm into all the other normal stuff, but like, that's only crazy. So thing. you're saying like you a throat goat? Yeah, I can do that. <laughs> oh, yeah? <laughs> All right, so Shorty's clearly is a jump off, bro. 
So there ain't no gold digging, nothing about this. Shorty clearly ready to go, jump out. Let's see homeboy capitalize on it. Or let's see a homeboy just try to flip a narrative and still worry about why she didn't say nothing to him before she saw his whip. Because you know what they do, man. They worry about the wrong stuff at the wrong time. Okay, I'm going to need to see about that. All right. Let's if, see. If you're serious, for real. Yeah, let's do that date then. Where you want to go? What let's, type of food you like? I like sushi. Sushi? I love sushi. That's crazy Perfect. you said that. You like, no, no, no boo got sushi? Love yes. Sushi? That's the first place I was thinking of too. Okay, yeah, we could probably rock out with Nobu. That's perfect. I cool, love it. I'm cool with that, but uh, I ain't coming second to no dude though. So you gonna have to make up your mind what you wanna do. Yeah. I ain't saying you gotta leave him or no, sh but you know. Definitely, I, I'm definitely gonna have to think about that because I might have uh, another runner up. You mean another runner up? You. <laughs> you funny. A runner up is crazy. <laughs> so like, <clears throat> what you like to do? Um. I like to work out. I like to go to concerts. Oh, my favorite thing is comedy clubs. Comedy clubs? So mm -hmm. you like to laugh? I love to laugh. Okay, okay. So what's your kind of guy though? Um, like I was saying, has to be smart, has to have his sh together. Homeboy literally just asked her the same question again. She already told you what type of dude she into. She already said the business, smart, have something. Can't just be some old regular degla ass. And shorty simple, bro. Said like the last so he go eat some sushi, go to a fucking comedy club, go to the crib and hit. It's that simple, bro. I mean, you ain't gotta go to a comedy club. You can go see a comedy movie if it's cheaper. Cause you know them tickets at them comedy events be kinda expensive. Them motherfuckers be trying to charge you one hundred, something, two hundred, something dollars. I ain't saying expensive, expensive, but y'all know what I mean. Two hundred something dollars is to fucking laugh, or three hundred something dollars is to fucking kiki ha ha. And you know man, and that's just a small venue. We if you trying to get into them big ass them big ass venue motherfucker, <laughs> you be somewhere nine hundred thousand dollars just be on front row. You know what I'm saying? Just to get some kiki he he laughing on. But um, yeah, learn it, bro. You, he literally, homeboy sitting in the car like he has no intentions of ever pulling off or starting his car or, or no intentions of moving. And another thing is, if you looking for, if you looking for a shorty that's wiping material, bro. I'm just saying, if he's looking for it, you're not gonna be talking about sexual favors and you're not gonna be. Talking about all that stuff within two or three minutes of you actually meeting him. See what I'm saying? Like, that's what's just, that's what's throwing me off about homeboy. Homeboy really talking about all these little sexual things, this, that, this, that. And you only met Shorty for like, what, four or five minutes? But you're looking for wife material because wife material is not going to talk to you about stuff like that. Only jump offs are going to talk to you about stuff like that within the first four or five minutes of you meeting them, bro. Just to clarify some stuff, you know? So that should give you some indication of what type of bride you're dealing with. Another um, funny is definitely gonna be a, a big plus for me. Um, an entrepreneur, like you were saying. Are you funny? I'm funny as really? I just, you just ain't seen it yet, but okay. I'm a goofball for real, for real. Oh, really? Yeah. I like that. Okay, good, I can be goofy too. So you believe in 50-50? Um, what is that supposed to mean? Like what bills? Like <laughs> what's, your, what's your take on that? Oh wow. Um Why you say oh wow? I mean I'm surprised that you would ask that so so soon, but I'm just think. asking. I don't wanna waste time. I see, I get you, I get you. Not really, but I guess it depends. Like it depends on the situation. Like if you're if you have a family, I, I think I would rather be a stay at home wife and I I need the guy to be making all the bills. A stay at home wife. Yeah. Why? Because then I can do my own thing, I can work out, uh, hang out with my girls, and then take care of the kids, raise them. I don't want no random raising my kids. Mistake number 1,415, right? Because we actually been counting, right? But no, um, talking to her about 50-50, talking to her about stuff that's completely irrelevant. Because we don't forget. We don't motherfucking forget. At the beginning of the video... What did, I said something similar to this. Make sure you act interested in what her interests are because if it's about what she's interested in, right? So why are you talking about 50? Motherfuckers not worry about that. Motherfuckers worry about going to get some eat, going to a comedy club, having a nice little laugh, or going somewhere having a laugh, nice little laugh, and going back to the crib and getting busy, bro. Why are you worried about some 50-50? Once again, he's failing to follow the conversation, y'all. He's failing to stay on topic. So, 
once again, you, you, you can't call nobody out for anything, bro. You're not even on the subject here. You're just going from here, not, not adding anything to the conversation and bouncing to this subject. And like, I told y'all, man, these dudes is weird, man. I've been telling y'all that. How can you go from that to, how can you go from, okay, I want to, how can you go from, okay, well, she 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 trying to do this do this do this, but you worry about what type what type of lotion a motherfucker put on their ankles type shit. Yeah, y'all probably like, wow, that don't make sense. That's the whole point of me saying it. It don't make sense. You see what I'm saying? So, <laughs> boys, nigga, they can't even follow. You can't even follow a conversation. Sad man. And this is who motherfuckers is really believing is pimping. No, no, I feel that, I feel that, but you you basically saying you don't want to work at all. Maybe I could do like a little something from home, something easy, but I don't really, I wouldn't want to like do all that, no, like no. spend my whole day working, especially if there's a family. So what do you expect from a guy that you like dealing with? What do I expect from him? Yeah. What do you mean by that? Like, what you expect, like what's, what's some non-negotiables for you? Um... Well, I definitely don't, wouldn't allow a cheater. So, definitely have to be loyal and faithful and honest. That That is very important to me. Um, good communication. A lot of, like, the basic stuff. Right. Nothing too. So, you don't require, like, nothing that's too out. No, nothing, nothing too crazy. I'm not really super crazy jealous. Um, it's, yeah, everything is, like, pretty, like, chill with me, I think. Okay. Okay, I feel like the stay-at-home wife thing is negotiable. It's negotiable. I, you don't I, like that? No, I feel like it's like situational. Like if I'm if I'm the type of guy, like say I'm a rapper or a singer, I'm always on the road all the time. Obviously, I would want my wife to be a stay-at-home mom because I'm gone most of the time. You mm -hmm. know what I mean? So, like you said, we don't want nobody just raising our anybody just raising our kids. Yeah, yeah. You got exactly. kids yet? No, I do. How old are you? I'm 27. Okay, okay, smooth, smooth, smooth. Yeah. You look younger than that. Oh, really? Yeah. Thank you. I'm 26. For real? Yeah. No, you're not. I'm 26. I swear. <laughs> you're straight face right now. No, I'm serious though. I'm. T are you? I'm dead. Ass. I love. I love how straight your face is. Cause I'm being serious though. I'm 26. Well, damn. Damn, I look old. Hold on. I look like an old man or something. No. You don't. I don't know why. It just, it's just like <laughs> your face just made me laugh. That's why. <laughs> nah, you don't look old. I promise. I promise. You're just really tall. You got a Lambo already at 26. Like it's not really adding up. <laughs> I mean, I'm just successful. Wow. I mean, yeah. <laughs> you don't believe people can be successful? I mean, what? Damn. 26. What did you do? Like I told you, I'm into real estate. When did you start learning that? Like at 18 or something? Nah, 21. No, matter of fact, 22. So you were just grinding for like four years? Like straight, straight grinding? Most definitely. I can't believe I'm older than you. <laughs> Damn, you over there weak. You crying? Did everybody <laughs> cry? <laughs> I don't know why. I just got the giggles. I see. <laughs> the giggles well, look, now, now you crossed off the funny in the checklist. So see, I told you. So that's good. <laughs> Well, look, though, we going to get some sushi or what? Yeah, let's do it. <laughs> well, for real, though, let's get some sushi. You got to be ready to match that energy after, though, like you said, though. Um, yeah, of course, I'm down. You seem like a good time. Let's let's do it. I'm ready. Um, where you was headed to? My class, which probably just missed at this point. <laughs> oh, you did say, like, 15 minutes. I mean, you, it's, it's better to go than never to show up, though. Uh, f it, whatever. Where, just... where is it at? Um, it was like down the block over there. I'm gonna drop you off. Mm, no, let's just go to sushi right now. So you probably wasn't even going to class for you. I was. I was. You want to look it up? No, nah, I don't want to do all that. <laughs> what I say at the beginning of the video? Didn't I tell y'all offering a person to walk on the class and all that? When he when he fucked the conversation up in the beginning of the video, to where he couldn't capitalize over time about I'm going to Pilates, and he didn't he wasn't inquiring about Pilates, well, yoga, not Pilates, but yoga. Then he wasn't inquiring about yoga. He wasn't like, well, hey, I will walk you to your yoga class. That's cool. We can talk and what? Did not. Now at the end of the video, he wanna I can drop you off. You want to da 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 this da da. da. 
Anyways, man, let's, it's this video almost over, man. Let's see what else this nigga talking about. So, where was you really going, though? Seriously. I was really gonna go to yoga class. Look at me. Well, look, seven. I can take you right now. You know what I'm saying? I actually got some things to do, so I'll I hit you up for the sushi later. Damn. I got your number. Didn't you put your number on? Yeah, okay, so as long as it, as long as you're still down yeah, for down. later on. Yeah. Tonight? For sure. Alright, cool. I'll drop you off. It's, it's, where is it at? That way? It's, yeah, it's around the corner. Alright, it's moving for sure. I'll take it. Alright, so that one wasn't that bad. Be honest, 100 with you, that one was not that bad. Um, I ain't gonna lie, man. That was alright. That one was alright, man. That was alright. You know what I'm saying? Let me know what y'all think in the comment section below. That's all I'm saying. That one was all right right there, man. That was, that was kind of all right right there. Uh, like, comment, share, subscribe, man. Let me know what you think about that. Let me know. He, fucking, he was fucking up in the earth for how he talking, how he moved, but that one was all right how he ended, you know? Like, comment, share, subscribe. Share this to social media platforms, man, and we out to the next one.